Hello there and welcome back to Yorkshire Live. I hope you're doing well. There's still plenty more to look forward to as we're at the opening of the new South Bank campus at the Leeds College of Building. Now though, it's time for your good lines, which are some of the more positive news stories from across your region. And first up, a formerly homeless man from Leeds has travelled abroad for the first time to take part in a huge charity sale in Paris. 22-year-old Josh Holroyd, who now lives and works at homelessness charity Emmaus Leeds, was part of a team that attended the Salon Emmaus in the French capital. A group of six people from the charity teamed up with community members from Emmaus Mosley to take a van load of bric-a-brac, clothes, textiles and small furniture items to sell at the event. On Sunday the 23rd of June, Paris Expo welcomed more than 120 Amawas groups from across Europe to sell a wide range of items, with all the money raised being used to support international Amawas projects, which tackle poverty and social exclusion. Joanne Stafford, projects and events leader at Amawas Leeds, said this was the third time she had taken a group of companions over to the Amawas Salon in Paris. She added that it's amazing how they managed to get so many Amaos communities all in one place, speaking different languages and having different ways of doing things, and yet working together so fluidly. Next up, Yorkshire is set to gain a brand new adventure park. The Axiom project is already set to bring some of the biggest retailers and a new, a new sports stadium to the region, and also part of the plans is a huge adventure park. The park will include extensive man-made water features with the teaser video showing footage of a high wire assault course, a huge inflatable area and a dry ski slope, as well as an off-road driving experience and a one-person roller coaster. That's all for your good lines for now. Remember, you can send us your good news by emailing news at leadslocal.tv.